Convection ovens are ovens that cook food faster than a regular oven. This is because convection ovens use fans to circulate the hot air. Some uses include baking and roasting. To turn on the oven, press the power button and use the dial to preheat the oven. It will then start a countdown. The cook hold button allows you to keep the food at a safe temperature. The cool down option and the light button are two safety features. The light button is used to turn on the light so the food is visible in the oven without opening it. This ensures one's safety so that the oven doesn't have to be opened. The cool down option will further be discussed in the breakdown portion of this video. The doors are difficult to open, so make sure to be cautious when opening the doors. Make sure you are not standing directly in front of the doors because you do not want to be in contact with the heat when it escapes. Instead, stand to the side and open the doors slowly and slightly to allow the hot air to come out. Then open the doors all the way. An additional precaution is to use oven mitts to take out the food from the oven. To cool down the oven, the fan must be running and the doors must be slightly open. To clean the oven, make sure it is cool. Then, take out all of the racks and wipe the inside with the wet cloth with soapy water and sanitize. Both 20 and 30 quart Vera mixers are typically used for baking purposes. Depending on the amount of product you want to make, you will have to decide between using a 20 or 30 quart mixer. These are the attachments for the 30 quart mixer, and these are the attachments for the 20 quart mixer. Dough hooks are used to mix bread dough, while flat beaters are used for softer dough or batter. To use a Vera mixer, insert the desired attachment. Then, pull the lever to lift the bowl up to the proper position. Select the desired speed and how long you want to mix it for, if applicable. Make sure the rear guard is in place and shut, and press start. Press stop when you're finished. Make sure the rear guard is closed before turning on the mixer. If the rear guard is lifted while the mixer is running, it will stop. Make sure not to put any of your body parts in or near the mixer while it is running. This will prevent injuries. Instead, use the provided chute. When you are done using the Vera mixer, lift the rear guard up and pull the lever for the mixing bowl down. Proceed to take off the attachment and bring all parts to be washed in the dishwasher.